A true Houdini master can place thousands of objects exactly where they want them, every time with speed and precision. So what's stopping you from doing the same? Absolutely nothing. Welcome to Geometry Essential 6, Scattering and Distribution. In this course, we're digging deep into the fundamental concepts and techniques behind scattering and distributing geometry, and even more importantly, distributing values. These are essential skills for any kind of environment or layout work in Houdini. Noise and random functions might seem similar, and both play a crucial role in procedural workflows, but which one will give you the specific results you're after? The key is to understand how they distribute values, and that's what we'll be covering in detail in the first part of this course. We'll examine their technical differences and cover practical examples for each one, like using noise to create natural and organic distribution, and using random to avoid patterns and trends. To really get to grips with a scatter sop, we first break it down into its granular components. We'll help you understand the clumping nature of random functions and how to use point relaxing to smooth those clumps out. You'll also want to be able to control exactly where you're scattering your points, and we'll show you how to do it all procedurally using masks and noise to drive point density. From there, we're getting up close and personal with attributes. You see, working with attributes is very similar to working with pixels. So if you have any experience working in image editors like Photoshop, you'll realize just how many of these skills can be translated to Houdini. We'll introduce you to classic color correction tools and COPS and show you how you can use VOPS to make the same adjustments to shape attribute values and control random distribution. And of course, how to blur attributes to soften and expand your masks and selections. When it comes to orientations, the orient attributes king. It's a quaternion, and traditionally its technical nature has been a hurdle for new users to overcome. Thankfully, things are made a whole lot easier with a scatter and align sop. We'll teach you how to use this powerful operator to generate and control the orient attribute on both new and existing points. The ability to scatter and distribute geometry is crucial, but the skills you'll gain from this course go far further than that. You'll learn how to precisely control the distribution of values, and it's this knowledge which will serve you time and time again in all kinds of procedural workflows. So start mastering scattering and distribution today with Geometry Essential 6 at hitflask.how.